Edward, it's so great to see you again. Five Thank years you. ago, a lot has happened in five years. Who would have thought what we've been through right in the world? These mobiles are all pre-COVID, just before COVID. And then when COVID struck us, of course, I was at home all the time and depressed to tears. So I tried to create, I created happier paintings and paintings with more color like this one and that one. And I was going through a very difficult personal period as well as a COVID period. And I lost two very, very dear friends to COVID. So I just stayed in the studio and painted. And the painting is very intricate and very meticulous. And that sense of repetition kept me very calm. And what are you using for um, your materials here? The same thing I've always used forever and ever, a paper mache masa or a paste over wood. This is over wood. With some of the figures there over wire and and clumps of paper that have been dipped in glue and squeezed together. These are very, very new. These I paint on the roof, not here, because every layer needs to dry a certain amount before you add the next. Gorgeous. I do a certain amount of painting on the roof because the Mexican sun is so hot, every layer will dry rapidly. Then I turn the water hose on it and wash off the excess color. And what you get is what you get. That's not my only painting technique, but that's one that I like to utilize. I've been making art since I was a child, and it's now such a way of life and a habit, I don't think I can stop it. As long as I have the energy, I will continue. I'm 78 years old, and um, I hope to continue to the last breath. <laughs>